Hey, up, dudes? Kublicon here, and welcome back to Skyrim. So, uh, Yasmina Manaranaranananana was able to make it. Look at this beautiful girl. Look at her. Daddy would see you so proud. Yeah, uh, she hasn't exactly passed his level yet, but uh, she has made it through into the Ragged Flagon. I'm telling you, this one is different. Is it me? Well, well, color me impressed, lass. Woo! I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Oh, God, yeah. I almost got killed. No risk, no reward. Oh, okay. That's the way it goes, so you better get used to it. <laughs> now, if you're done belly aching like a child, excuse me. How about handling a few deadbeats for me? <laughs> like you just get shoved off at the corner. They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. All right. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. Sure, let's do it. Kirava, Percy, Honeyhand. And Hilga. Hilga. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. All right. Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't. <laughs> Just to be keep molding with this lady. A word of warning, though. Hey, lady. I don't want any of them killed. Bad for business. All right. Consider it done. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. I would love details on my marks. Kirava's stubborn. But she's got a soft spot for fun. So threaten her children. Talk nice. To Talon J at the B and Barb, and see if you can get something out of him. They're well acquainted. If you catch me, I'm aware of this person. They uh, they watch me every now, time I walk through. Mount follower of Debella dotes over the statue to the divine that she keeps at the bunkhouse. Use it as leverage, and she'll cave. All right, I like as it. Pig-headed a man as you'll ever find. The key is that ugly dwarven urn in his shop. Smash that thing to bits and he'll change his attitude. All right. I'll be here when you're done. That works for me. Is anybody here uh, willing to sell me I'll stuff? Can you show me a sneak? With me and he'll oh. Never even know you I don't have enough money. <laughs> I'm poor. Got a lot of nerve coming down. I'm oh, trying to this, become a thief. That. Don't act like this. Well, you have a lot of salt, I... which would be good for making some stuff. Hey, you pretty lady. Advice? Talk to Brynjolf. Got better things to do. I can't steal from any of these things. If you're looking for Convert Beckel and me, we have a thing going. Try anything with him and it'd be bad for your health. Okay. Um, I'm actually more interested in ladies like you. You know if, uh, yeah. what I mean? Th these horns aren't just for show. Wink, 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 wink. Am I? Okay. What do I got in here? Railway faults. Storage cabinet. Hmm. Well, I think I'm uh, just not going to piss these guys off. Taking care of business. <laughs> oh, in the water. Oh, I'm all wet. Uh, that was such a bad joke. Uh, sometimes it happens. But, you know, when you're a beautiful girl and uh, you're trying to pick up all the other pretty girls, sometimes you just got to work it. Can I make this go up, too? <laughs> Woo! I like it. I have the power to make it go up and... There's a mace here? You know what, let's pick it up. I have a hunch that um, I'm about to go, like, just do some store stuff. And so, worst case, I can throw it on the floor. I'm just running over the dead bodies. It's like, yeah, it's fine. Just don't worry about them. All right, let's uh, let's go talk to our favorite people to be in the barb. I'm a little tired of that guy always acting like I'm trying to steal all his stuff. Let's do it. Also, it's nighttime, so I'm gonna be able to get in here physically. Hey, what do you want? How did you meet? Kaiba? I met her when I wandered into Riften a few years ago. Aww. Been smitten with her ever since. In fact. I'm thinking of asking her to marry me. Your eyes are all flickery. In Black Marsh, tradition dictates we present a potential mate. That was your to represent our future Aww. bond. That was I your have the gold note. Band, That's cool. But all I need are three flawless amethysts to complete the setting. Wow. I uh Sure. I was hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my place to ask such a favor of you. I thank you. With the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. 
The last thing I want is a war with your people. Thanks. Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Hey, I understand. Rava has Don't some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, she might just listen to you. Just please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. Meh. Apparently it's bad for business. So, but I'd like some water, please. Of course. Thank you. Yeah, that's right. And, uh, good luck with the whole wedding thing, man. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to... So, attend. lady. Here for a room or something to drink? Are you ready to pay? No, and I never will. Now get out of my inn. How could you possibly know about huh? Huh? Please, my family means too much to me. Don't hurt them. Honestly, I'm, uh... I mean, uh, no, then pay up. Well, here. Take this back to Brynjolf and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. Very good. So you apparently we're just a bunch of... Man, or I could just run with the money. Now, you know what? I may be a thief, but I'm an honorable thief. That doesn't make any sense, really. Most, there's no honor among thieves, generally. Oh, I was looking for a store like this so I could sell stuff in. So can I also steal stuff from. Today? Oh, a message. Uh, wh what? Oh, it's one of you. Honey hand. Mm. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? What's this message? <sighs> Simple. You don't pay. Bad. Petty threats and fist waving are not going to sway me. You people are all talk. And Is this the guy that I break the pot for? You demand payment for protection. And you can't even protect yourselves. Don't fool yourself. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of Riften. Likewise. Now I have a lot to do. So I'm afraid... Let's see. Collect his debt. Smash his prized dwarven earth. Just have to leave. Alrighty then. Mm. Man, I should steal some of those potions while we're here. <laughs> Boop. I think my person just yawned. She's a little tired. Oh, here it is. I'll be back. Mo ha 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 ha. Mo ha 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 ha. Ha ha. Ha. Where's the other one? So wait, let's see if I'm getting tired. Uh, not yet. How look his bunkhouse? Can I help you? Um. Oh, uh, that was a lot easier than I expected. Surviving a Horker attack. These are the giant, uh, like, walrus things that they got in this game. Look at that. Look at that guy. It's so crazy. Alright, um. Come see me in the market if you're looking for the finest custom jewelry in all of Skyrim. Sure thing, big guy. Please, oh. don't take the statue. It's the only thing of value I have left. <laughs> you don't even know I took it. Not Lady Dibella. No, please. Oh, she looks so sad. Me. Well, I get the message. Here, take your gold. I hope you choke on it. Choke. I keep making references to uh Oh, quest statue of Dibella removed. Uh oh. <laughs> Apparently I lost the quest. Riftens under my protection. You watch yourself now. Well, I'm just basically strong-handing everybody who works here. Uh you guys asleep yet? Hey. Oh no. You're the one from Brynjolf's outfit, aren't you? Uh. Oh. There's no need for that. Oh, and uh, look. I even have the payment I owed. <laughs> Here, take it. Oh no. You're the one from Brynjolf's outfit, aren't you? <laughs> you, uh, you aren't very good in the head, are you? Catch. It. I ended up selling that ship to open this place. Seemed only fitting to name it after her. Well, changed it a bit, I suppose. 
If I had been smarter, I would have kept my boat. Coming to this. I have just strong armed you to make you give me stuff. Um, what's wrong with Brifton? I'm trying to buy from him. My husband bears Oh, well, there we go. That works out. Let's uh, let's go back to our buddy. Oh, glub glub glub. Thursday. Boop. Oh, need more. Boop. There we go. Gotta stay hydrated. That was a lot easier than I expected. There was the option to brawl, and I was like, don't worry about it. And I don't know why that guy caved. Maybe he'd just been, like, seeing what I've been doing. I mean, I could have crushed his urn, but I didn't. So I think that's, you know, an all in all good. Honestly, I am strong arming people, which is bad. But guess what? I'm Yasmina Mina, Nana, and I'm just trying to make my way through the world. My father wasn't able to do it, becoming a bard. So I'm going to do it my way. You know? Show them that the uh, cons can really succeed. Sup, dude? Stay out of trouble. So oh, got a job's trouble. done, and you even brought the gold. Best of all, you did it clean. I like that. Yeah. Dumping bodies and keeping the guards quiet can be expensive. Ah. Well done. And it would seem I owe you something in return. Mmm, I like doing business with you guys. I think you'll find these quite useful. These? Potion of sneaks. What's next, Judging then? from how well you've handled those shopkeepers. I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. Cool. That's the spirit. Larceny. Larceny. The telltale sign of a practice thief. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. Oh, thank you. What's on your mind? I don't know what I have to ask. Oh. I've run into a rough patch lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. You're not even looking at me. Say it to my face. You keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Fair enough. Fair enough. Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me and I'll show you what we're all about. Sure. Let's rock this. Woo, check it. I got an achievement in the bottom. Loud and clear. Hey, dude. I think you better listen to Mercer and Brynjol first. All right. We could talk later. Kai, you sound a lot like Jason Statham. So, what's in the closet? I'll show you the operation. Oh, that's cool. Then you can ask your questions. Sweet, let's go. Nice, I finally made it into the guild. Still can't steal from these. Hmm. It's nice being the quiet thief. You know, just sneaking around, talking like I know what I'm doing, but honestly, I have to eat tons and tons and tons of cooked horker meat to win a fight. All right, this is a pretty cool area. So, what's uh, what's going on? Is this where all the poop goes? I don't know if I want to jump in the water again. Mercer, this is the oh, one I was talking. I'm a bit hungry. Ignore my stomach. Better not. Actually, let me just eat in the middle of our conversation. I have a lot of stolen food. I might as well uh, eat some of that. Continue. I want to make one thing perfectly clear. Yes. You play by the rules, you walk away rich. You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. Do what we say, when we say. Do I make myself clear? I'm kind of a. Yeah. I'll let that comment go because you're new. Well, thanks. Ask things out of turn again, and we have a problem. Now, are we clear on all of this? Uh, sure. Good. Then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Kai? Wait a moment. You're not talking about Golden Glow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work. So, let her prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. Huh. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. Okay. He needs to be taught a lesson. Okay. Grignol will provide you with the details. All right. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Mm -hmm. Since 
Grignolf assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Woo! Welcome to the family, lass. Thanks. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin, so don't disappoint me. No problem. Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. All right. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs you Cool. Way. Oh, and talk to Tonelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Nice. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched Bees. little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf smart named Arangoff. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing out the safe in the main house. Oh, that's extreme. The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Because he's still buying stuff from it. The guild depends on an arrangement of influential people to keep things running smooth. So we're basically... Without them at our backs, we'd be in serious trouble. Huh. Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive, but if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, Jeez. kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. I'll do my best, big guy. What do you tell us? brought in a mountain of gold for the guild. Burn three hives. You could almost call it our I just yawned in the middle. Don't the worry, I'm paying attention. Mercer was, well, angry to put it kindly. Mm. So we send in Vex and find out he's hired a bunch of mercenaries to guard the place. And you want me to go in? Aye. Arangoth sent the city guard packing and fortified the well, entire crap. island. In fact, Vex barely made it out of there alive. You should talk to her about it before you go. Jeez. Alright then. Uh, I guess I'll light these on that island. things on Those fire. Don't take prisoners. So I could just search these chests. Tough. I respect that. Bringing in a lot of coin for the guild. Make oh, I thought you were gonna be a jerk to me. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Sure thing. Nice. We're rocking with the more steel daggers now. Boom. We don't need that there anymore. We got two of these. We can do a grindstone. Eyes open. Keep my eye on sapphire. Sure, I'll take the snowberries. Shadow marks? I don't know, but that's an expensive book, so I'm taking it. Yeah, I'm already a good thief. Don't you have better things to do than disturb me? Uh, I'm just reading your shit. So fine, jerk. Man, got some delicious foods for me, us to take. We are sitting pretty in this place. Leather strips. Oh yeah. Another expensive book. Yoink. Cooked horker loaf. Oh man, we made it. We're into the thieves guild now. We've got some a serious job to do. Hey you. A minute. Wanted to say something. Yeah. My father told me he found me as a young boy in the wreckage of a ship that sank off of the coast near Solitude. That's cool. All he found in my pocket was a tiny smooth stone inscribed with some sort of strange runes. You know. No one does. I've even taken the damn thing to the College of Winterhold. Huh. I must have spent every last coin I've made with the guild trying to find out what it, it might be just someone who's scrawling for goofiness. Perhaps. They could be nonsense. Inane scribbles done by someone in idle boredom. Yes. But if not, if they actually mean something, they might tell me where I'm from, what ship I was on, everything. I guess that's true. Keep to the shadows. Hmm. What's up, Piles? Fruits, salt piles, foods. Nice. Let's build up our lock picking skills. Okay, I'm not gonna use a steel great sword. Thieves guild gloves. Thieves guild hood. Huh. Thieves guild boots. Oh, I didn't need the pickaxe. Hide armor of minor conjuring. Man, they're arming us well. I'm 
lock chest novice. Did it. I don't really need the hides. Oh, it's practices. Well, that's cool. Let's see if I can do this one. Okay, we're not doing that one. <laughs> nope, nope. Okay, we're not doing that one. Alright, we're not doing those. <laughs> but hey, we got some new armors and stuff too. This is sweet. Let's see what we look like. Uh, hide armor of minor conjuring. Hide shield. Thieves Guild boots. Pickpocket success is better. Lockpicking is better. Prices are better. And we're not doing those. Nice. Let's get, give us a look-see now. Yeah, oh yeah, we, do, we look all like sneaky and stuff now. People are gonna look at you and be like, eh, I don't know if I can trust you. And that's exactly what we want. So, uh, dudes, you know, I feel pretty good. A very talking episode today. Uh, but we got also nice and armored, so, you know, if you liked yourself, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And leave me a comment if you want to, if you feel too much talking, or if talking's good. I can skip through some of the stuff, but I like hearing some of it, because I like story element in here, too. But yeah, just give me a heads up, because the whole point is to roleplay this character. So sometimes, we gotta understand and work through all this sneaky, sneaky, sneakies. So anyway, dudes, um... Uh, spiel, 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 spiel. Kublai Khan out. Absolute pleasure to play with you today.